Welcome. Today we'll be discussing the process of nuclear fission. Fission is a type of nuclear reaction where a heavy nucleus splits into two or more lighter nuclei, releasing an enormous amount of energy. This energy can be harnessed for peaceful purposes, such as generating electricity in nuclear reactors or devastating purposes, such as atomic bombs. The fission reaction begins with a slow neutron bombarding a heavy nucleus, called the parent nucleus. The neutron excites the nucleus and breaks it into smaller nuclei, called daughter nuclei, three neutrons, and energy in the form of gamma radiation. The daughter nuclei may be two or three in number. For instance, when a slow neutron bombards a uranium nucleus, the nucleus gets excited and breaks into barium, krypton, three neutrons, and 200 million electron volts of energy in the form of gamma radiation and kinetic energy of the daughter nuclei. The neutrons released in this reaction cause further fission reactions of other nuclei, thus initiating a chain reaction. The minimum mass required for a chain reaction is called critical mass. Below critical mass, the chain reaction doesn't occur, and above it, the reaction is self-sustained. In nuclear reactors, the fission chain reaction is carried out in a controlled manner. The energy produced in this controlled reaction is used to generate electricity. However, if something goes wrong and the chain reaction is not correctly controlled, it can result in the release of a massive amount of energy, leading to a devastating explosion, similar to an atomic bomb. In conclusion, nuclear fission is a powerful process that can be harnessed to produce energy or to release a massive amount of energy in a short period, as in atomic bombs. Thanks for watching.